We have word out of Indiana now that a Texas company is responsible for a pipeline spill where 8,000 gallons of jet fuel have spilled into a river in northeast Indiana. This is around the city of Decatur. They're saying the Houston-based Buckeye Pipeline says that it shut down the pipeline after detecting a pressure problem. And they're saying that this fuel had spilled into the St. Mary's River in Decatur. This is a community of around 9,500 people. And the officials say that they put booms in place to try to contain the fuel and that it was being vacuumed. So they're trying to vacuum off the, the surface of the water. And they're saying it could take weeks. So the EPA says it's monitoring its neighborhoods and businesses near the river. But we've seen where that goes. So I'm putting it into the hands of the people. On a day like this, a lot of stories get swept under the rug. So I just want to let it be known this is what's happened in terms of this. Where you have 8,000 gallons of jet fuel dumping into the Indiana River and... If you want to find more, make sure to follow me on Twitter. I can't stress it enough. I air it out over there. So if you want to find some of the most breaking stuff, the most crucial information, Twitter. Oh, yeah. While we're on jet fuel here, jet fuel can't melt still beams. Sure can't. It's been Dabu 7. Awaken. <laughs>